He's been the captain of his own ship for 35 years, taking tourists on sunset cruises or taking them out for a big catch. And I love what I do. I've got one of those perfect jobs. But Captain Dan Adams, owner of By Request Charter, said he's being kicked into retirement and the oil hasn't even made it to Pinellas Shores yet. But the captain's phone only rings for cancellations these days. I thought I'd retire and then sell the business and buy a boat and cruise around for the rest, you know, the rest of my day that I was functional. And now, how do you sell something that has no value anymore. On Monday, Captain Dan finally filed his claim with BP. With slip rent for his boats, a mortgage, and a 14-year-old daughter to raise, reality is quickly setting in. If you're gonna go fishing, you're gonna go to the beach, do it now. Get out, go to Honeymoon Island, go to Caledicia Island. If you have a boat, take it out. So that's exactly what he's doing, because he says he doesn't know what his paradise will look like next week or next month. So he wants to soak up every beautiful sight. The dolphin playing tag, feeding time. He's afraid even the sun will have no place to cool off at dusk with an ocean full of poison. As you can see, some folks are still out here fishing for the evening. Others are just here to watch the sunset. A big concern for this community is that crowds will no longer exist here in Dunedin after the oil comes closer to our shores. As for Captain Dan, we will be checking back with him on Thursday. That's when he's expected to hear back from BP on his claim. Reporting in Dunedin, Rebecca Medina, ABC Action News.